WikiLeaks is truly massive innovation. It's like mm -hmm. uh, uh, cryptography, uh, uh, internet, and journalism, and also like the scientific paradigm of publishing the source source material, right? So Assange combined the, all of this into this entity WikiLeaks, and and that's how uh, yeah, that's how he he he. Uh, he set new standards suddenly, you know. Suddenly, traditional journalism looks truly stupid as it has been for a very long time, but not everyone, not everyone was uh, aware of it. And they just, it's like, how dare this guy do this uh, uh, so uh, with such integrity and without, without, uh, without co compromising anything? They, they not only brought, uh, the, the, you know, the truth about what was, what was happening uh, in, in very important issues like wars, <laughs> you know, co wars concern everybody because they have repercussions even generations later. Mm -hmm. uh, but they also showed uh, to which degree the media were absolutely corrupt and yep. uh, absolutely not objective. Of course, uh, the, the magic word the journal most journalists use is uh, oh we have a balanced coverage when they say that you can be sure that they are uh, censoring uh, lots of stuff and also introducing disinformation uh, into what, what they are publishing because for them balanced means uh, telling you exactly what their boss uh, is expecting them to tell you they, they couldn't ignore wikileaks because it was either we, we, we partner with WikiLeaks and and you know we, we try to rip as many uh, profits and benefits as we can, or we don't partner with them and we will look truly stupid. So they had to partner with WikiLeaks, mm -hmm. uh, but you know it's quid pro quo. It's like oh, uh, this is going to piss uh, to piss off the government and the establishment. So we will we will uh, publish some stuff from WikiLeaks, selected stuff, not everything, but in order to uh, replease again our our true masters. We are going to destroy this guy Julian Assange. They they are in permanent. They've been in violation of uh, of uh, Julian Julian Assange's uh, rights as a human uh, being, and uh, also uh, in violation of international law because uh, Julian Assange I think has I think has a diplomatic uh, has been having a diplomatic passport. Um, yes. uh, since uh, mm -hmm. for, for a few years now, so he shouldn't. Right. He should ha absolutely have the right to leave the embassy, uh, get get mm -hmm. in a get in a car and go to to the airport and go to wherever wherever he wants. Right. And people should remember that it is Western uh, countries, Western governments, who are after Assange. It's not mm -hmm. Iran. It's not mm -hmm. Russia. It's mm -hmm. not uh, Iraq. Uh, it's mm -hmm. not Venezuela. Right. Mm -hmm. It's not Cuba. It is the US, it is the UK, it is Australia, and it is uh, so many uh, other, uh, most European countries. Um, he says that the enemy, uh, the enemy, his enemy is, uh, is ignorance. And that's, uh, I think that's why, that's one of the motivations why, why he created WikiLeaks, is to educate mm -hmm. people about the realities of the world, what's really going on. Uh, as compared to what uh, what people are being told for, from their. Yeah.